I'd like to start us off in a good way. Empetu washte, michiku api. Shante washte, napachiu zapi. Patrice kunish imachi api. Hello, my relatives. I greet you with a warm handshake and heart. I'm Patrice Kunish, the commissioner for the administration for Native Americans. I am excited to launch this year's panel review process with you. I have such deep appreciation for your commitment to this work. Some of you are returning re reviewers, so thank you so much. Panel review is an exciting time for ANA. ANA's financial investments make tremendous impacts in the lives of so many people in Native communities across the country. Native, Native Hawaiians, Pacific Islanders, Alaska Natives, and American Indians. As you know, ANA has made significant changes to this year's NOFOs and funding process. All five of ANA's NOFOs have been modified. We appreciate the all-in HHS simplified NOFO project that culminated in our final NOFOs. We made these changes to reduce administrative burdens on both applicants and grantees, streamline the application process, and respect the spirit of self-governance in Native communities. ANA's new NOFOs now use plain language, reduce redundancy, and eliminate unnecessary terms, all of which have reduced the length of the NOFOs as well. In addition, the new NOFO content and structure are easier to read and navigate. As importantly, ANA is moving toward a new funding approach for our awards. This means that instead of funding three-year projects on an incremental annual basis, ANA will fully fund grant awards in the first year of the project. This will allow grant recipients to determine how they use their funds over the three-year grant period or longer periods for language immersion projects. This new funding process also eliminates layers of paperwork required to renew grants and modify projects every year. All of this means that ANA will be able to focus its efforts on supporting our grantees and their projects in producing the best outcomes for the people and communities we serve. The applications you are reviewing for this panel session have been already screened for eligibility. That brings us now to the process of reviewing applications, arguably the most important work of this process. Very soon, ANA will host an introductory meeting with the panel review teams, comprised of pa panel managers, the chairperson, and fellow reviewers. You are providing critical assistance to ANA by helping us identify the best projects and ensuring that the federal funds entrusted to us support optimal social and economic well being of our Native communities. Our job is to support you throughout the process. Our staff can help you with any issue, and I encourage you to contact your panel chairperson or panel manager for any help along the way. We also welcome your feedback on the redesigned NOFOs and any other suggestions you may have to improve the merit review process and experience. A survey will be provided to you at the conclusion of these sessions. We hope you will take the time and let us know what works well and what we can improve upon in the future. Lastly, I cannot stress this enough. I and the Native communities and peoples impacted by the work you are about to embark upon Sincerely thank you for your service and dedication to this panel review process. Please know that our collective work protects native languages, teaches the littlest learners, creates jobs and bolsters tribal economies, protects our environments, and increases the self-governance capacity in many native communities. You are a critical part of making this all happen. Wopi Latanka. Thank you very much and be well.